dino dilemma. So, when I started the dinos this spring, um, from the very beginning, I realized that the smell really bothered me. Hello, Malakali. Why? What do you mean by So. Yeah, I'm gonna finish right there. Yeah. Um, so really quickly, I realized that the smell was really a big issue for me. And from the start, my dad told me he didn't want me to have a rooster because uh, he really didn't like the cocoricos. You know, the cocoros. And, uh, well, yeah, you see, things changed as I was having the dinos. Saria! Saria's calling me. She's in the nest box. Really? Daria might be laying an egg. Yesterday there was a weird egg. So if she lays an, uh, an egg today, maybe it was her or Kudo yesterday. Anyway. Um, so quickly I realized that um, yeah, uh, my dad didn't want the rooster. Because he really didn't want the singing, the crowing, and I know, boys. I know, the girlfriend's right there. Um, but then the thing is, the brown dino and the gray dino, they were roosters. So we had to let go of them. Um, but then I got melancholy. <laughs> it's just a bunny. It's just a bunny. Sorry, there's a bunny running around and uh, the chickens freaked out. Um, so, yeah, so I got melancholy and. I quickly realized that melancholy was really sad. Like I mean, I named her that for a reason, you know. Um, so yeah, I named her melancholy because she she was really sad. She sounded really sad. She acted really sad. She was really depressed. Um, come on, come down. And when I contacted her previous owner, he told me that she'd recently lost a rooster she really liked. And so I thought maybe um, she was mourning because she didn't have her rooster anymore. And this got me to get Kitana. Uh, I got Kitana because um, I really like this Spartana breed, and I had been in contact with a breeder um, who was supposedly gonna have chicks soon, but then I lost contact with them, and then Katana game came up as being for free, and I figured, well, you know, um, I can breed them with Melancholy, and go from there, you know, get my chicks and get my black crested dinos by myself that way. Um, so, you know, I figured I would do that. 
Now, my dad wasn't very happy that I got a rooster, but he can't tolerate it for my own sake. You know, he really liked how I spent a lot of time outside because of the dinos. And um, so, yeah, he put up with it. Uh, but soon enough, he started complaining about the crowing. How, because he, he is a very light sleeper, and when he gets woken up, he has a lot of trouble falling back to sleep. So, it's an issue for him, you know? And, well, you see, his patience is running out. So I don't know how much longer he's going to tolerate Anna's presence. And um, Kuro and Saria were not playing yet. I don't know, maybe Saria is right now. I don't know, I'll, I'll know in a bit. I'll check on her, because she was playing earlier. Um, but... when he's the buddy then yeah. um, so yeah so now I'm dealing with dad's patients running out um, he stresses a lot over uh, if someone's gonna make a complaint about him having a rooster even though we have neighbors that have roosters um, and have had them for longer than we did he worries a lot about it, and I understand his worries. I mean, he got the gazebo for the bunnies so that I would be lower profile, and here I am with a rooster singing, the road crest singing to the whole neighborhood, you know? Um, but, I mean, personally, I asked the neighbors that were behind us, and they really don't mind Katana, they think he's gorgeous too, and they really liked him when I introduced him to them. Um, but, yeah, now my issue is, I do not want to chop him, you know, I think he's a gorgeous boy, he's a good boy, um, yeah, he's a bit of a rat, but uh, he's been doing a good job protecting the hens, and um, he's handleable. I mean, look at this. He wants to go, but I'm just holding him down firmly and able to uh, groom him without too much issue, you know? Um, even though Melancholy keeps calling him. He keeps hearing the others say something's wrong because there's a bunny walking around. He clearly wants to go see him. Um, where is it? I'll let you go in a minute, boy. So, yeah. So, if I was to let go of Katana. I have the issue that I really don't want to separate him from Melancholy because Melancholy really likes him. I mean, look at her. She she's like, let him go. I want to walk with my boyfriend. Um, she really really likes him. She always follows him around. He follows her around. Um, they stick together like glue, like more than any of the others. Those two are um, a great couple. So wherever Katana would go, Melancholy would have to go. But then like when you give your animals to someone else, you're relying on them keeping their promises and not giving them away again. Kinda like the people who gave me Katana, you know? Um, so I'm struggling right now because I feel responsible 
I think that getting Kishana was not a mistake. Melancholy really needed him and she really likes him. I would I would hate to see them be separated again. You know, for melancholy to be mourning another rooster. Um, <laughs> she really wants me to let him go. Um, so that's the gist of it. But then there's also. Taking care of the dinos has been heavy for me. Like, um, like I've been caring for bunnies for several years now, and like unless I'm really ill, it's not a problem for me having this many rabbits. But the dinos have been draining because um, I let them roam around my cage. Uh, sorry if he starts growing. <laughs> this is the other boy, the bunny that's growing. Um, yeah, that. Um, so yeah, so. If I was to let go of Kitana, I have to let go of Melancholy at the same time. And then, well, Pluto is kind of part of their flock. And I'm not too fond of Pluto, so might as well let Kudo go. But then, I really, really, really like Sakya. And I kind of really like her. I kind of really would like to keep her as a pet but at the same time if caring for the dinos has been such an issue for me um like keeping Saria would be kind of silly you know so I don't know what to do um Dad would really like me for me to get rid of Katana. Sorry, I shouldn't have to move the camera, but I wanted to check on Saria. Uh, so, he would really like for me to get rid of Katana, but... It's a struggle for me right now. Um, it would be a relief to not have dinos anymore, because, as I said, it's been kind of taxing for me. But also, um, you know, I like him. And sorry about that. I really should not have moved the phone. Shouldn't I? Uh, so yeah, so in between my feelings of liking my pets and wanting the best for them and struggling with it and not wanting to upset my dad too much, you know, I, I'm, my brain's in a whirlwind. Like it would be easier if I had a friend that could break, that could raise them for me. Uh, I could go see the neighbor, ask them to raise them for me. But at the same time, I kind of don't like that. But at the same time, I don't like the neighbor maybe, but I don't have a friend that would take them. So that's out of the window. And yeah, it's a struggle. big struggle to decide what to do about this and I really don't know what I'm gonna do well for now
I'm going to take care of everyone, every bunny and dinos. And then I'm going to go to bed, I guess.